Speaking of which, now that you mention it, what am I holding right now? How much? Oh, fuck, I don't need. Uh, I think I can last. I think I. I think I can make it. I think I can. I think so. <laughs> well, yeah. There's so much. Uh, I never knew. Like when we were trying to get into a terminal previously in another stream, I kept going, kept going, kept going. Then I'd stop, just like that, to try and reset it the old school way. Cause I just wasn't sure if. I'd have to find a perk to unlock them again. And I thought they'd be locked forever. I'm like, oh shit, this is a disaster. That plus, like I said a, a moment ago, all the, the weapons, I don't need to worry about repairing them as much. At Fallout 3, I used to go around, I'd pick up a p another pistol or two just because I'm using the one so often. I'd go to repair it, turns out it's it's not... It doesn't need to be repaired. But then why is it saying to repair it? I don't understand. What the hell was that? I see birds. Watch out, they'll peck your face. Dog, where are you? Dog. Where the fuck did the dog go? Bro. I don't see him. This is not good. Where are you going? Are you are you going or what? Uh, I don't want the casual outfit. This is just GTFO. Let's go. Oh dog, there you are. Oh, I missed you. I know. I love follow through. That's what got me turned on to the game. Onto the the series. You know, I was looking at it thinking, you know, there's just so much to be done in it, and it looks confusing. Then I tried it, and I'm like, oh, I like this, I like this, I like this. Mind you, when I first started it, I completely screwed everything up. And I killed too many people. I thought everybody was an enemy. It was that a trench coat? Dirty trench coat. Oh, yeah. I like that. <laughs> Fucking dog! What are you doing? Dog. You know what? Like my dog at home, man. I turn around here, you are getting kicked around the face. I'm trying to run between everyone's legs. It's not smart. You're not battle ready. Go home. I wonder if this is this dude here. You know, he's set on a mission. Before I get there, I'm thinking in the back of my mind right now, is he one of those guys who are like, Oh, they, they must be doing this, they must be doing that, we have to go and stop them. They get there and it's just, like, underground operations of selling pies to the homeless. Here he is going, thinking they're selling- OH SHIT! Oh, not bad. Not bad at all. For the pies. Are you gonna shoot him or what? That was my shot, I swear it was. Hacks, bro. Hacks for the win. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I did it. I did it all. You all just sat there. You all sat there. You guys did nothing. Pieces of crap. See, that's what happens to you, dog. That's what happens if you sell pies on the Underground Railroad, huh? What the hell is that? It sounded like there was a fairy above my head. What the hell was that sound? I'm glad they don't die. As far as I know, they don't die. The companions. I said my only fear right now is that this guy is a bit of a quack. You are right. Let's go. Uh, I'll follow you. Yeah, they were. I think they were very... Very awesome in Fallout 3. I, I don't, yeah, I don't really like any of them in Fallout 4. Like the closest of the Enclave I've even come across would be the, the eye, thing that follows you around and says random shit. Okay, let's go into this. I thought it said ABC Jet.
Fallout New Vegas, I think I made it to the end. But never really got to explore as much as I should have or could have. Like, I got all these different weapons and shit, all this different crap I explored, but I don't think I, ex I explored as much as I could have. Which is something I sort of regret. Like, there's weapons from what I understand I never even got. I just shit myself when I found this one sniper rifle up on, on a hill. Oh shit! I'm sorry. I hope we weren't trying to be stealthy. If we were, I, I've just fucked everything up. What's in here? Uh, uh, let's take it. Let's take it. Let's take it. What the hell are you doing? You're going through the... Oh. <laughs> I thought it was going through the rack. But yeah, I don't really like the factions here. I don't like the Brotherhood or any... I think the power armor looks cool, but it, they all just seem like a bunch of quacks. Compared to before. Wonder glue scissors. Like before, when I, when I first started Fallout 3, I haven't played any of the games prior to that. You know, I thought it was awesome. I saw this one dude going across the, the wasteland, and all I see is him with his massive armor on, and he just looked... He looked like he was ready to kick the shit out of someone, and I didn't want to be that someone. Activate units. I don't know. Okay, so security concerns. Get together. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't, there was a lot in Fallout New Vegas, but it felt more like Fallout 3 in a different area, and there was just so much that could have been improved on. Like, I never really got into all the mods and everything for the weapons, as much as I have on Fallout 4. But, yeah, I just, I couldn't get into it as much as Fallout 3. Fallout 3, I felt more connected to the game and the characters and the storyline than New Vegas. You know, New Vegas is just a typical Mojave story, you know. Well, a guy woke up, you know, uh, turns out he got shot in the head, didn't remember what the hell was going on over a poker chip. So he stranded the desert. He walked around the desert for a while. You know, that's, that's what happens in the desert. That's what happens in Vegas. Like, fuck. Bro, you got fucked up. Bro. There ain't shit. There's not shit. Oh, hey. Circuit board. Lively. Oh, besides that circuit board, there isn't really anything around. Holy shit. Oh, fuck. It's just you. Take the desk fan. That's pretty much all we need in here. Yes, look at these wrecks. Hammer. What are you? A dish rag. I'll take the dish rag. I might need to wipe the, the blood off his face later, you know. You never know. What the hell was that? Uh, are you coming? What the hell? What are you doing? Paladin dance. I see that. I see that. Damn it. I was hoping look at the evidence. There isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. Maybe they all fucked up. Oh. Roger that. I hate the synths, man. Just I I don't I don't care what they are, what they do. It's just they look all fucking creepy, man. Like terminator on drugs. This place is a mess. But I still see a few pieces of salvage that the brother that might be interested in. After we're done here, we'll have to mark this place for sweet. Oh, you can kiss my ass. I'm taking all this shit. You aren't getting any of it. This is mine. I'll fight your ass for it. Oh, goddamn. More terminals. Uh-huh. Reminder, password security. Uh... Changed monthly, please do your part. I'll fuck my life. Automated password change. Is. Please do not reply. Oh, well, shit. We have three months to do this shit. 
Alarm clock. Let's take the alarm clock. Okay. Let's do it. I'm being serial right now. Nailed it. Lab controls. What else do we got? That's all we got. Okay. Let's open the door. There better not be ghouls and shit in there. If there are, I'm gonna be fucking furious. Oh, well. What? Oh, I thought they were ghouls with guns. Take it. Oh, well, that ended horribly. Uh, how do they take these guns? They're like their own guns. Holy shit! That was awesome. Well, they take very kindly to their own guns. Take it well, take it well, sir. You knew it. You knew it was coming. You knew it was coming. I don't want the shock baton, eh? I like the weapon I got. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. I don't need to fucking repair it. Yeah, that's what I thought. I saw the guy come out, his face all torn of shit, and I could have swore it was a ghoul with a gun. It scared me shitless. Well, I'll let him deal with that crap. I'll walk around here. What the hell was that sound? Or was it me? I think it was me. Possibly. Like, there's so much shit you can't even pick up, though. Like, that lamp over there? I would take that. I would fucking take that in, in a heartbeat, bro. That's what I would do. You're so into this, bro. You're so into it. I appreciate it. Thank you. You keep killing everyone. I'll take everything. You do it. I'm doing everyone a good favor. Oh, you got fucked up. Let's take the typewriter. Take that. I don't want the pen. I don't think we need the pen. I'll fight. If anyone comes this way, don't worry. I'll take care of them, though. I'll take care of them. Right fierce. Are you locked? Oh, God damn it. Oh, well, one turn of that and the thing broke. Oh. Oh. Mind blown. I just realized what's... Okay. So the reason for that, I assume, originally, you get close to breaking your bobby pin. You'd leave. Old school. You'd leave. You go back in. Try it again. I don't think it resets the bobby pin. I think it keeps using the same one you just used on the last door. Like, whatever you tried unlocking previously, it uses, it reuses that bobby pin. So, if it was about to break, it's gonna be in that same state, if that makes sense. There we go. See that one try. Yeah, yeah, you keep going that way. Have fun. I know they're gonna be coming through taking all this shit. Oh, oh I thought there was a birthday hat. Take that. I'll go back that way afterwards. Okay, dog, let's go. Remain vigilant. We've got turrets ahead. Yes, let's remain vigilant. Vigilant all the way. Oh, shit. And you want me to go that way? Oh, fuck no. Oh, I have a feeling they're gonna come through here. Ah, bring it. Is that the turret? Oh, see? I took care of all of them. Oh, shit. Let's take care of this, guys. Take everything with copper. I know. Oh, my God. Everything needs copper. Oh, my God. Take it. Take it. Take it. Good boy. Or girl. I think that was perfect. Okay, well, you know what? I think I might have to end it here, though. I might have to end it here. So I hope you all enjoyed watching today. Thank you very much, Rachel, for commenting and coming back continuously, watching everything. So, obviously, 100% this will be uploaded within the next couple days. So I hope you enjoyed it, and I'm sorry for cutting it so short so quickly. Thank you all very much for watching again.